Good morning, everybody. This is Nate Hoffman with G Suite for Healthcare Providers. Uh, as promised, I wanted to step on and talk about how to create a really simple expense tracking system using your G Suite. So, number one, I'll be going up how going over how I set up my form to be able to do that, and then also we'll be going over how that can then be transferred over in onto your phone in almost an app form so that you can easily access your form on the go and upload files directly from your phone such as a picture of your receipt for example. So here we go. Here is the form that I've created right here. All right? Business expenses is what I've called it. All right? I put date of purchase, item purchased, price and then reason for purchase. And then below here I have a receipt. What I want what I want to show you is how I how I um, added that. So first, when I, if I add a new question down here, and if I type in receipt, I'm also going to come down here to file upload, because this is what's going to allow me to upload a picture. And maybe I want only specific types, so I'm going to go with image. I mean, really, that's all I would have to do if that's all I wanted to. Maybe just in case I'll put a PDF or maybe any other kind of document. We want a maximum, I don't know, maybe I have multiple receipts, so we'll put a maximum of five uploads, and we'll call it good with that. Okay, so that's what I've done here um, with my previous one, so I'm just going to go ahead and delete this. Delete that. There we go. Oh, from the bottom here, delete that. And... I did this another time as well, so we'll delete that. Okay, perfect. So there you go. I have all of my forms ready to go. So now what you want to do, if we want to preview that, we come over here. This is what it's going to look like. It talks about switching accounts up here if you have to, but anyway, there's what my form would look like if I do it all online. But I don't necessarily want to do it on my computer. Rather, I want to do it on my phone. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that now. Okay, so as you can see here, my business expense form is added to my home screen on my phone. It's right there next to my ESPN app. Now, the way that I did that was first I went onto my browser on my computer. I got a link to the form itself, and I went ahead and texted it to myself. You can do this from an email as well. Just email the link of your form to yourself. Open it up in the browser. What you're going to want to do, though, specifically, is open it up in Safari if you have an iPhone. Um, because it gives you, from Safari, it gives you the, the ability to put it on your home screen. I know that this works with droids as well. That's something that some of you would have to look up to be able to make that work. So the way that we do this is we come to the square with an arrow right in the middle. And we're going to come along this bottom row right here that you can see moving. We're going to go to Add to Home Screen, and that's going to put it right on the home screen, which is what I've done here. So if I click on that, it's going to open up right to my form. And I'm going to go ahead and put in this information. I'm going to say it is August 16th, 2019. Item purchase, let's say gas. Price will go... Uh, $26, reason for purchase, um, meeting out of town, so I had to drive out of town or something like that. And then what we want to do here is add a, add a file. What, you, what you're going to do is put, push on select files from your device and that's going to give you the opportunity to take a photo, right? So I'll just go ahead and take a photo of this so you can see what it looks like. We're going to use that photo upload it and that's going to upload it directly to your form there it is I'm going to push submit right so if I come back to my form on the computer right I can see right now that it has indeed been added to my form you can see here's the date that the timestamp for when it was added data purchase all the data that I had and then if I come over here to the actual photo, if I, if I push on it, it'll take me to a link directly to the photo. So you'll have pictures of all your receipts as well, along with tracking of everything you need. Anyway, 
So that's how you do it, folks. Pretty simple stuff, right? And super user friendly. Now, that said, also, if any of you guys need to purchase G Suite below, in the comments below, I've added a link to G Suite that gives you a little discount. So um, anyway, again, feel free to leave your questions. Love you guys, and we'll talk to you later. Bye.